It's all right. Now time to talk about the weather, see what's happening outside. And we have some chilly temperatures all across state. Cold front came in last night and pushed in a much different air mass compared to how our weekend began. We were in the 80s for highs. Now that's how our current temps are looking. Here's how we're going to be in the afternoon. We're only going to rise to the lower 60s, so well below yesterday and below average for this time of year, too. Another gray, cool day with those clouds sticking around as the upper level low makes its way through. And that's going to continue to push eastward. Triggering showers and thunderstorms in its path, especially along and north of I 70. And this precip could come down in the form of snow for areas above about 9,000 feet especially west of the divide. So we'll be watching for that into the afternoon. Now the future cast shows the likelihood for those showers through the midday hours. Let's put it in motion and we'll pause it around 4 p.m. So it is going to be a soggy day. We'll watch for some downpours, not so much a threat of severe weather, but heavy rain possible. And we even could see some hail. Already had that this morning. Had a viewer report from the Pinery with hail reported there around 6.30 this morning. So our future cast shows that we still could be in for those showers past dinner time, but they'll become more sporadic once we get past sunset. Scott Skies will partially clear out overnight, a drier day tomorrow, so out of the weekend tomorrow looking to be the warmer and the brighter day out of the two, because today we're only going to be on either side of 60 degrees. A cool day up and down the I-25 corridor, looking at your front range forecast numbers. Here's your forecast and writing for today, 61 degrees, occasional showers in the morning. Watch for some slick roads and some standing water, too. Not good news for runners that are going to be out there early this morning, but we'll have a nicer day on the way for tomorrow. But this rain certainly very welcome news for the fire up there in Larimer County. A reminder that our Like, Watch, and Win contest is continuing, and tomorrow we're giving away an Xbox 360 with the game Ridge Racer. So to enter, go to thedenverchannel.com for a link to our Facebook page, and we'll be picking a winner Sunday night on 7 News at 10. In addition to going online to uh, find out about like watching win contest, we want to find out more about this happening today. It's denvergreenexpo.com.